Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Trending Reviews. So my friends at Fantic sent me across a brand new product. It's a electric screwdriver. Now there's a lot on the market, but this is a very cool design. It has an LED display on there as well. I'm gonna give you an unboxing. This is called the Nex N1 Pro. So it's currently crowdfunding on Indiegogo right now. I'm gonna leave a description below where you can check out the crowdfunding of this. It's currently smashing its goals. But if you are watching this video in the future where the product is already released, then I will update the description with the purchase link for this as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you an unboxing. I've got a shelving unit that I've just bought. I'm gonna use this electric screwdriver to set up that and in a lot quicker time than I would normally have with a manual screwdriver. So I'm gonna showcase some of those samples here. I've got a whole bunch of these screws. I'm gonna be hopefully getting this completed in double the amount of time that it normally takes me to set up a unit like this. So I'm gonna do all of that, showcase that to you guys, and then let me know what you guys think, and let's get straight into it. All right, let's take a look at the box. Got a nice little set of instructions here, how to use me. Inside, you've got a user guide, a little card here. Then you have the actual pack as well. Now this is a heavy duty case. So you've got a slider here. Very convenient. So you have a whole bunch of different types of screws here that fits the majority of the different types of screw faces that you might come across. Then you have the actual gun. Now the good thing I like about this is that it's actually a USB-C powered screwdriver. So there you can see the USB-C port at the bottom. It's got very nice design there, very easy to hold in your hand. You also get a USB-C charging cable there at the bottom and then that's it, you're pretty much ready to go. Now the good thing I like about this is that it comes with an LED digital display. Now you turn on the device by simply just pressing down on the red trigger button there. As you can see, it just turns on and then you have the LED display light up. Now on the front here, you have something called a shark chuck locking system, whereby you insert the screw. So let me take one of these, for example, you push it in slightly and it locks into place. Then to release it, you pull the drill head right there outwards and then it comes out. It's very secure, very easy. When you use it, it does have a LED light there on the front. It's a ring light. So in case you wanna screw something in the dark, maybe outdoors in the garden or something like that, then you have a little light like there to help you drill and see the screws in low lighting. The other thing I like about this as well, it has an electronic brake. Now what that means is when you're screwing in other different types of electric screwdrivers, it will take about five seconds to slow down and come to a complete stop. Whereas in this one, it comes to a complete stop immediately as soon as you let go of the trigger. So for example, there you go. And it is a palm sized electric screwdriver with an extremely comfortable grip and it's easy one handed operation. So let's briefly talk about the LED display there. So you have a few things. You have a directional arrow, a number, and then four bars here. The top one is actually the direction of the drill. So you can reverse that with the direction button there. If I press this, as you can see, if you wanted to take a screw out, you point it downwards. If you want to screw something in, it's upwards. Then there's six levels of torque. Now the torque level indicator there is from one to six. And here's a full listing of each of the levels and the amount of torque that each of them get. So take a look. Level one is the lightest with 0.5 nanometers. And level six is the fastest with six nanometer torque. The little bars there at the bottom are the battery indicators. So there's four there, which indicates it's between 75 to 100% battery life. If you have three bars there, then that will mean it's between 50 to 75, and they all go in increments of 25%. So if you have a one bar just there at the bottom, then it would be time to charge the electric screwdriver. Now this does have a 2000 milliamp hour battery, which takes roughly an hour and a half to charge fully, which gives you a, a massive amount of 260 screws on a single charge. So that's really convenient. It's so easy to take away. And now that everything is USB-C nowadays, it's just the perfect companion to have, especially if you do a lot of DIY around the house. Now it does have variable speed control as well. So the tighter you press the trigger, the higher the speed you're going to get. And it allows for a stepless speed change as well with a maximum rate of 220 RPM. All right guys, so now there's nothing left for me to do. I will then to go and construct my new shelf, use the electric screwdriver with all of these screws here that came with it. There's plenty of them in there. 
I'm gonna let you guys know how long it took and then uh, give you a review of how this performs. So let's take a look. Alright guys, so thanks for watching. So as you can see, this shelf is done. It took no more than half an hour. This is a really cool gadget to have around the house. It's perfect for DIY. If you want to construct a few things here and there, you just need to have one of these. It saves so much time. If I didn't have this, I would probably take maybe about an hour, just half the time with this little electric screwdriver. It's awesome. USB-C, I've got charging cables pretty much everywhere in my house, which is USB-C. So it's really convenient. I don't even need to use the USB cable that comes with it. If there's anything else you wanna know, then drop a comment. Otherwise, I hope you like that video. I hope you subscribe. I've got tons more cool little gadget ideas coming out like this. Otherwise, thanks for watching guys, and I'll catch you at the next one. Take care.